Welcome to Total Network Inventory Tutorials and Examples. In this video, we're going to talk about the basic operations with assets in your storage. All operations with assets are performed in the network tree. Let's explore it now. Here you will find all assets added by the scanner manually by synchronizing your storage with Active Directory. The network tree replicates the file structure of the open storage. In this area, you can perform various actions with assets, such as quick viewing, sending for rescan, moving or deleting. You can also divide assets into groups and perform the same actions with the groups to save time. Let's create a group and fill it with assets. All we need is to open the context menu and click the corresponding option. Then name the group. Now let's move several assets to the group. Moving can be done via the context menu or simply by dragging the assets with the mouse. The program provides three ways to select an asset. The first mode is selection with the mouse while holding the Ctrl or Shift key. This mode allows performing various operations with assets, but it affects only the network tree. This type of selection doesn't have any impact on the output of data into the main working area or on the content of reports. The second mode can be activated by clicking the multiple selection button. Unlike the first one, this mode is intended only for working with data in the main area of the program, but doesn't affect operations with assets in the network tree and its context menu. The third mode is combined. You can select assets with a mouse and then use the context menu to either move them to another group or activate multiple selection, thereby both selecting them and displaying their information in the main area. All three modes work for both individual assets and groups, which allows you to select the nodes you need faster. For more information, please visit our online documentation. Thank you for watching.